this fits both my phone and my wallet so I'm just gonna keep my camera in my pocket it's also raining really heavily right now. I hope the traffic isn't that bad. We're gonna be going to the mall. I really want to check out Pop Mart in Mid Valley. Tyler recently got me a Limu blind box and this is what I got. It's so cute. Ta da! So, yeah, I really want to go to Pop Mart and check out the other blind box that they have there. I hope this doesn't turn into an unhealthy obsession. Welcome to my toy channel. I don't want to get this. I don't want to get this. I don't want to get this. <laughs> I'm so sad. I got my second least favorite one. <laughs> so ugly. Okay, <laughs> Hello, hello everyone. Good morning. Today, I'm gonna be going out with my friend this afternoon, which I'm really excited about. I haven't seen her in so long. But before I head out, I have something that I want to do, which is to remove my arm hair. They have grown out so much and it's really bothering me. I don't want to go out like this. So I'm gonna share with you guys my body care hair removal routine and yeah i haven't shared much about body care on my channel before because i've always just been looking for a routine that works for me especially on hair removal i have pretty hairy arms you can definitely see through the camera and growing up i always didn't like them not that i'm embarrassed about them because they're natural it's nothing to be ashamed of but it's more of my personal preference i just like the way my skin feels after hair removal it feels so smooth and it also makes my skin look more healthy and glowy and overall just makes me feel more confident in the past i would use epilator on my underarms because it's able to get rid of the roots all together don't just shave them because it would darken your underarms but i believe it just hurts too much to be used on my arms and my legs i've tried it once and never again it just hurts too bad i've also tried ipl treatments by going into those beauty salons but i just couldn't find the time to go in that often because with ipl you have to be consistent with it in order for it to work and it's also pretty expensive but recently i have discovered this device from ulite it comes in this really fancy box. This is their Diamond Air IPL device. I've seen so many people raving about this device on both Xiaohongshu and YouTube including some of my favorite creators so I decided to give it a try. This is a medical grade IPL hair removal device and it's the exact same thing you get from those beauty salons but they have made it into this small and portable body. This is completely safe to use at home which is so nice. You guys know how I feel about driving so with this I don't have to drive all the way there just to get one session of treatment done and also in long term this is so much more cost efficient so 
Also, just a side note, if you guys didn't know, IPL stands for like pulse technology. It basically applies gentle pulses of light to your hair roots, which makes your hair go into resting phase and eventually fall out. This device comes with a sapphire lamp material, which makes it more efficient to transmit light. And they also included this freezing point technology, so it's cold to touch, which would soothe your skin while you're using it. I've already done my legs yesterday, so I'm gonna show you guys how I remove my hair on my arms. Let's go! Hello, I'm back from shaving my arms. This is not a wound, this is just a scar from a bug bite. I just want to note that it is advised in the instruction to wait for about 6 to 12 hours after shaving. So if you decided to get one for yourself, just take note on that. Gotta make sure you have the shades on while using the device to protect your eyes. So there are 5 levels on this device for you to control the light pulses and I personally use level 3 for both my arms and legs. I'm really scared of pain and I was scared of this as well before using it but this is completely painless, trust me. I try not to look at the light even though I have glasses on. It's also cooling on the top, but you need to make sure to lower the level on more sensitive area like underarm and bikini line. And yeah, level 3 works fine for me on my arms. You just need to try it out from the lowest level on yourself to see which one suits well on your skin. Okay. Wow. I'm just gonna finish it off with this aloe vera gel that they have provided in the box. With this or IPL treatment in general, you have to be consistent with it in order for you to see a result. I'm currently using it for about 2-3 to three times a week and I already started seeing results. My arms feel so soft now. I genuinely wish I got to know about this device sooner because it would have saved me so much money and trouble from going into those beauty salons. Ulight has also given me a code to share with you guys. If you use my code, you'll be getting this Sonic Electrical Toothbrush Set as free gift with your purchase. So if you guys are interested, I'll leave the link in the description box for you guys to check out. <laughs> Good morning everyone, I got Subway for my breakfast. I'm having iced Americano because I ran out of milk. Uh, and it's low-key very bad. I got a chicken sub and ta-da! I'm having a pretty late start to the day even though I woke up at around 8.30. I was just in bed scrolling through my phone and also did some chores because I have some laundries to do. That's all. That's how I spent the last 3 hours. My energy level today is pretty low because I got my period yesterday so today I just didn't feel like doing anything. This is my first subway in years. It's so good. My plan for today is just staying in to edit because I have two videos filmed that I need to get done. And also later in the afternoon, I'm gonna be heading out with Tyler. I wanna pick up some flowers for a shoot. So yeah, that's my plan for today. Mm. I'm trying to train my taste bud to like this because I have been drinking milk every single day and it's not good for my stomach.
bunkers. So this is like the full comprehensive abridged version of how Mia ended up in the PICU with RC, which is like this virus that affects children and her heart stopped twice. Because in my opinion, in my humble opinion, I got shrimp avocado toast and avocado milk. We got beef sandwich and ice latte. I got them and they have opened up so much I think these are the are like nectar kind of stuff but it wasn't there when I first got them they are so big now